Where can you meet 17,000 brilliant scientists and entrepreneurs revealing breakthroughs in biotechnology? It's here at Bio 2017 in San Diego. It's a new era of medicine, so let's go check out the companies making it happen. I'm here with Steve McCloskey, who is the CEO of Nano. And Steve, talk to me about what you're doing here today. I see there are people doing, you're doing some demos in the back here. Um, talk to me about this and how you came up with this idea. Sure, yeah. My background is nanoengineering. And uh, we built this virtual reality platform to allow drug designers to you know, really get inside of their molecules and start designing drugs more effectively. Uh, so we're currently here at Bio and we're you know, demoing this product to a lot of biotech researchers and drug developers, medicinal chemists. Uh, and they're you know, putting on the Oculus headset, uh, getting in there with their hands, you know, scaling up proteins, and then looking at that binding pocket and trying to design a new chemical. What made you come up with this idea? Yeah, um, well, I grew up, uh, you know, in the '90s and in 2000s as a gamer, and I uh, was always uh, playing around with 3D graphics and you know, all, all the latest, um, you know, PlayStation, Xbox, uh, computer gaming. And then uh, when I got to college and was a an nano engineer, um, you know, all the graphics disappeared, and it went back to um, sort of traditional mediums. So I always wanted to bring that, you know, that really enjoyable, like graphical experience uh, to things at the nano scale. I got into virtual reality in 2014 with the Oculus development kit, and I've uh, just been, you know, creating really great uh, applications to zoom down to the nano scale and see, you know, what's really going on, because uh, everything is happening at the nano scale all around us all the time. Uh, but if you never, if you never zoom down and look at it, uh, then you don't actually know what's going on. So you, know, you, you may have a drug that works, but if you don't know why it works. Um, then you don't know how to make it better, for instance, right? And is there um, a benefit then in terms of collaboration amongst other scientists and researchers using this tool? Definitely. Um, so we could have you, know, you or you know, anyone uh, port into the same server and interact with each other's avatars. So you know, if we're right next to each other in San Diego, uh, I could put on the headset, you could put on the headset, we could be next to each other. Then if a third person wanted to join in from um, you know, Switzerland, let's say, they would also be able to interact with us and collaborate. So we could all you know, share that same experience of interacting with proteins or data sets. Well, we wish you the best and we cannot wait to see what you're doing next year here at Bio. Thanks, yeah, looking forward to it.